Hey guys, uh, did my power hour tonight. Let me turn this off. Wasn't planning on coming out here and working, but uh, <laughs> I brought some tools down here that were up at the, uh, the garage. And uh, <laughs> one thing led to another, and I ended up coming down here and working anyways. So I did about an hour's worth of work, and uh, uh, I finished stripping the hood. The trunk I finished... Um, Earlier this week, um, let me flip it around here. Here's the hood, all stripped clean. There's a lot of surface rust, but none of it real deep. Uh, I am going to etch this, um, so I need to get myself some etch. There's a couple of imperfections, you can see one right there. Um, so, I mean, obviously, it's going to need some body work at some point, but. My plan is to just uh, get these two pieces into epoxy uh, and then set them aside for now until the entire car is in epoxy and then I'll go back through and do all the body work. So that's the plan for now. Um, both sides are stripped. Um, this one's actually uh, been sandblasted around the edges and stuff too. You can probably see uh, the sandblasting line. Uh, so this one's actually uh, done done, except for etch. That one I still need to go over the sandblaster on the bottom, touch up a few places, but some places that I can't get with the uh, polycarbide wheels. I'm using these <sighs> polycarbide wheels, um, some of them from Harbor Freight. Uh, I like the 3M ones the best. Um, but I only had one to try out, and uh, I'll get some more of these. It's, it's actually two of the polycarbide wheels sandwiched together, and, and I like that a lot better because uh, you got more uh, area on the end to work with, uh, and I do most of my spinning on the end, not on the face. So um, I like these. Uh, I like the 3M ones a lot better. I'll definitely get some more of those. So, progress guys, um, so I'll uh, get some etch, uh, the in-laws are coming this weekend so I probably won't get a chance to come out here at all this weekend, but uh, next week I'll get some etch and I'll etch these babies, um, and I'll get my blower installed, I think probably I could probably epoxy these without the blower, just using the, uh, the one in the window for now. Um, but if I get the chance, I'll get the blower hooked up too. That's it for tonight, guys. Thanks for watching.